So what are we going to learn today? Money, finance and economics. Wow, great job. So Ishan, what is this? Trade. Trade. Okay, and this is a diamond ring, right? Which is bigger in size? Okay, but whose uh, worth is more? Whose value is more? The diamond ring. Yeah. So we see that even though the train is bigger in size, but the diamond ring is worth more. It costs more money. So what do we see? That things have value and size does not matter. Great job. Ishan, what is this? Penny. Okay, a penny is worth? One cent. What is the color of penny? Brown. And it has the picture of? A brown ring. So we see that a penny is just worth one cent. Great job. Ishan, what is this? Nickel. Okay, a nickel is worth? Five cents. What is the color of nickel? Silver. And it has the picture of? Thomas Jefferson. How many pennies make a nickel? Five. Okay, here. Great job! Done. What is this? Dime. A dime is worth? 10 cents. What is the color of dime? Silver. And it has the picture of? Franklin, Franklin Roosevelt. Roosevelt. How many pennies make a dime? Ten. Okay. Great job! Chan, what is this? Quarter. A quarter is worth? 25 cents. What is the color of quarter? Silver. And it has the picture of? George Washington. Okay. And how many pennies make a quarter? 25. Okay. One, two, We talk about cents when we talk about coin. Great job. Okay, so Ishan, this is a nickel, right? And this is a dime. Which is worth more? Dime. Exactly. So even though nickel is bigger in size, but dime is worth more. We saw in the diamond and the train example that size does not matter. It is the denomination, right? Again, Ishan, penny is more or dime is more? Which is worth more? Dime. Exactly, even though penny is bigger in size, but dime is worth more. Ishan, a penny is more or nickel is more? Worth more? Nickel. Exactly, nickel is worth more. This is a quarter, right? And this is a dime. Which is worth more? Quarter. Great job. What is this? One dollar. Okay. One dollar is worth? Hundred cents. And it has the picture of? George Washington. Ishan, we talk about dollar when we talk about? Pennies. Great job. Let's do some more bills. Ishan, what is this? One dollar. Yes. What is this? Five dollar. What is this? $10. What is this? $20. What is this? $50. And what is this? $100. Great job. So Ishan, we talk about cents when we talk about? Coins. We talk about dollar when we talk about? Pence. Okay. Cents are? Small part or a fraction of the dollar money. And bills are? Multiple. Of dollar money. Exactly. Great job. This is a penny. 
and this is a dollar. So how many pennies to make one dollar? Hundred pennies. Exactly. So let's do it. One, two, three. Ninety-nine hundred. Great job! So we see that hundred pennies make one dollar. Great job! Nickel. Yes. Yeah. And this is a dollar. Yes. Yeah. Ishan, how many nickels to make one dollar? Twenty nickels in one dollar. Exactly. And how do we get the answer? I'm going to make a five. Exactly. So can you do it? Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, Great job. So we see that there are 20 nickels in a dollar. Mm -hmm. And Isha, when we count by fives, the numbers end in? Five or zero. Great job. And this is a dime, dime and this is a dollar. How many dimes to make one dollar? Ten dimes. And how do we get the answer? We kind of made it ten. Exactly. Let's do it. Ten, twenty, nine, hundred. So we see that there are ten dimes to make a dollar. Right? And Ishan, when we count by the uh, tens, the numbers end in? Zero. Great job. Ishan, this is a quarter and this is a dollar. Ishan, how many quarters to make one dollar? Four quarters. And we count by the? Twenty-five. Let's do it. Twenty-five. Twenty-five. Fifty. Fifty. Seventy-five. Seventy-five. And hundred. Hundred. So we see four quarters to make one dollar. Great job. So Ishan, what are we going to do? We are going to do pretend, pretend play, play, shop and money. Shop and money. So I'm the shopkeeper and you're going to be the customer. You're going to buy things from me. Okay, so let's start the game. Hi sir, what do you want to buy today? The soap. The soap is for three cents. One, two, three. Thank you sir. Okay. Hope you like this soap. Have a great day. Okay, so what do you want to buy, sir, today? This is for five cents. Thank you, sir. Hope you have a great day. Hello, sir. What do you want to buy today? This egg. This egg is for eight cents. Five, six, seven, eight. Thank you, sir. Hope you like the eggs. Have a great day. What do you want to buy, sir? The milk. The milk is for 10 cents. Bye. Thank you, sir. Hope you like the milk. Okay. Uh, what do you want to buy, sir? This Thomas Gray. This is for 27 cents. 20, 25, 26, 27. Hope you like the toy. Have a great day, sir. Okay. Uh, what do you want to buy, sir? This item. This is for one dollar. Okay. Thank you, sir. Hope you have a great day. Thank you. Thank you. We're going to be studying economics now. So, Ishan, can you tell me what does exchange mean? Exchange. 
change is give one thing you receive another thing in return. Great job! Can you tell me what is money? Money is a medium of exchange that people use to buy and sell. It can be in the form of? Coins, bills, checks and cards. Okay, and it is also a? Store of value. People save, save it. it and use it later. Great job! Ishan, you said money is a store of value people save to use it later. But where do people save their money? In the bank. What is a bank? Bank is a safe place to keep our money. And banks give us some extra money called? Interest. As an incentive to keep yeah. money with them. Yeah. Does money grow on trees? No. Then how do we get money to buy things and keep it in the bank? We earn? We earn money by going to work. Great job! Okay, so Ishan, let's work, learn what are needs and what are wants. Ishan, what are needs? These are the things that you really need to live life comfortable. Like? Food, clothing, shelter. Okay, and what are wants? Want, wants are not to send you to life. Health or hygiene. hygiene. There are things you like to have. You like to have like? A toy, iPad, pizza, oh. movie. Oh wow, that's amazing. Ishan, from the pretend shop that we played, can you give me each thing and tell me what is it is need or want? Egg. It's a need. Need. Correct. Toothpaste. Need. For hygiene. Correct. Soap. Need. For hygiene. Correct. Milk. Need. need. Correct. iPad. One. Correct. Thomas Rainwater. Great job! Sean, the money that we earn by going to work, when we get the money, we spend it on our wants, right? No, we spend it on our needs, then we save money, and then we spend it on our wants. Okay, but why are you doing this budgeting? Like first on your needs, then you save it, and then on your wants. Why are you doing it? Because money is finite. You must make wise choices. You spend the money, there's no money left to spend. Great job! Sean, why do we need to save money? We live during emergency, future, and college. We need to save money. And what did we learn? Learning to save also means learning to? Wait. And we learn from the bank example. If we save money, we get more money, right? Yeah. Great job. So Ishan. Here is a yummy cupcake. Now Ishan, I give you a choice. You can eat this cupcake now and enjoy. But if you wait for 15 minutes, I'm going to give you two cupcakes. Will you wait? Yes. So Ishan, you make a choice to wait. Yes. That means you decide to enjoy eating the cupcake later. Yes. That means you delay your enjoyment, right? Yes. This is called delay gratification. Great job! Now the 15 minutes are over. Ishan, I want to ask you something. How did you wait for 15 minutes with the yummy cupcakes being here? How was it possible? I played in the toys. Oh, so basically you distracted yourself, right? So Ishan, can you tell me what did you learn from delayed gratification? I learned to wait, self-control. And the ability to distract and yourself. And the ability to distract myself. Ishan, but what does delayed gratification give you? 
more if you wait later. So it gives you more if you wait and take later. Right, great job. Ishan, you have been a very good boy. Here is a reward. I give you three quarters. What are you going to do with it? Put it in my piggy bank. What does your piggy bank say? Save, share and spend. So how are you going to put it? I'm going to put it in each one. Okay, can you put it? Mm -hmm. Okay, and here is one more. Great job. So Ishan, one of them is your share. Who am I going to share with? I share with mom and dad and people that don't have money. That's a great thought. Good job. Hope you like the video. Subscribe for more videos. Thank you. Goodbye.